Hello guys, Ancient King Players, I'm Fabio Pisco and today we're gonna have a review first the unboxing, first the unboxing of course, then the mounting and then the review of the racing chair F360G. 36, sorry, 36G. So for the guys who can see. Yes! This is it! Don't forget to leave your like and subscribe if you like this video or if you know you're gonna like it because some people do. Yeah, and well, let's now go to the unboxing. There! See you soon guys! So guys, if you don't have a knife or, or something, just you add this. This works, everything works, even your your thief. But well, anyway, let's stop the bullshitting and let's open this. Let's now go to the mounting. There are some more parts I didn't show on the on the unboxing, but they are there. Here, I mean, they are here. So this is the the feet, the feet part. This is the the support for the for the chair, which lowers it or puts it higher. And well, we have the the wheels as well. Here they are. And that's mostly it. There's nothing more. Let's now go to the real mounting. So guys, let's start from the beginning, I guess. So this first goes in the base. Quite obvious. Yeah, anyone knows that. Even a dumb shit like I am on these, these kind of things. And well, after this, maybe this part, I mean, I'll not even bother taking this off anyway. Okay, on here, okay, not bad for now, I guess, so wheels, okay, sorry guys, but I, I have no experience doing the doing this crap, uh, anyway, I don't know if these wheels are, are really plastic or Teflon, I think that's the, the name in English, but if they are Teflon, they are really good, or uh, they are really good. Teflon are a good, a really good kind of plastic. Yeah, I mean, you can see them here. They look good. Anyway, let's now put them. And I should have done this earlier. Crap, anyway. I'm getting the I'm getting used to this. I could do this all day. Okay. Here we are. Nice. Okay guys, after reading the instructions, the instructions are pretty pretty clear. So you have four screws here. So you have to do the front one, front one. I don't know I know you don't see it, but well. Front front. You have to do this on the back. And you have four screws, two here and two inside here. I know the visibility is bad, but well, I'm doing my best. Now, let's put it... Oh, here it is. It is gaining form, I guess. Now, things are getting done. So, the, f the first part here, down here, was very easy. So, four screws, one of the two on the front and two on the back. Quite easy. Now this part is more harder. It's basically you need to to have someone if you can to to hold something because you have these three screws here, which are pretty difficult to to mount. And you have like so these are four, three these three screws, and you have to to hold this while mounting 
here or you're gonna have a bad time. He's holding it here. Empurra aqui, não, empurra aqui, assim, ó. Inside the thing. Camera, assim. So, you better have someone to help you. Or you're pretty fucked up. And I'm still fucked up with someone helping me. So, yeah. So, guys, now the chair is mounted. So, the bottom and the top part. And now, the next thing to do is to put the arms on. So, for you guys to see now, we have one part mounted. So as you may see, it rotates. That's why the bearings are here. So don't forget, you put the bearing on this side and you put the, the screw somewhere around here. You put this side and then you just screw it. Screw it! <laughs> now again to the next part. Now on the last part guys, just the thing for your feet. So this is quite simple, you just have to to put it here and push it. Just don't forget to do it on this position. Oh fuck! So guys, now on the final part. So my opinions and my little review as you may call it. So this chair for 100 euros is very good. So we have premium quality, this is the pros. Premium quality, you have a fit rest with cushion, okay? The fit uh, rest is not very, very resistant. It will bend a bit with, um, with the weight you put in it, but, well, that's quite normal because of the thickness of the, um, of the supports. But you can just put it a little back and voila! No bend anymore. You have the fit extension and you have the possibility of okay let's see what I my height is 175 this is how I look on the chair so from the side you can see that my head can rest here very good if I want to this position is good for gaming you can put it a little bit more straight if you want there's a switch on the bottom there are two switches one for going up and one for going down and the, the, uh, the one, the, uh, the another one, sorry guys, the another one is to control the, um, the angle of the chair, of the top part. So, if you want a more straight position, you can put it and lock it, so it's locked, as you may see, a more straight position. If you want to put it down, imagine you want to see your favorite series, let's say Game of Thrones, I don't watch Game of Thrones, don't bash me for that, but anyway, Imagine if you want to see your favorite series, you can control the, um, the angle you want. If you want to see like in a more sleepy position, you can choose this. Well, this is a good position for see the, the series, I think. If you are used to get like your feet on top of your, of your table, oh, this may happen. But there's why you have the feet cushion. So, the feet cushion here and you lay back you can lay back amazingly this is very comfortable guys i just advise you to use this most of the time if you want to see movies or your favorite series so guys resuming the resume the pros are premium quality the fit extension so the fit rest and the um, the angle change so you can change the angle okay that's the pros. The cons. Oh, and the pros. You have a price. 100 euros. For this price, it's almost impossible to get a chair like this. So, the, um, the only real con uh, I found, it's, the, it's really the, the fit, the fit support. But you just have to put it a little bit back and it will not bend. Guys, thanks a lot for watching this review, I am not used to the reviews of chairs, but thanks a lot for watching, don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you like the video and if you want uh, videos with more quality and don't forget to share the video, to share the video, sorry, and see you in the next video, I guess, thanks.